Today, I transformed into a slime and will be staying that way for the next 100 days. As a slime, I've been placed inside of a massive slime farm that I have to escape within 100 days or I fail the challenge. This farm is not going to be easy to escape either. With only one path out of the farm, I'm gonna have to solve tons of deadly challenges to earn items that will help me in my escape. Lucky for me though, I can unlock different slimes with insane powers, like the cloud slime who lets me jump insane heights. Using these slimes is gonna make my escape possible. So without further ado, let's escape from this farm. Okay, so I am a slime. I'm a very tiny slime. At that, but that's okay. The smaller I am, the harder it is for me to see. So that actually works out to my benefit that I'm nice and small. But anyway, welcome to 100 Days as a Slime. Obviously, our goal is to escape this farm within 100 days, and that's gonna be our goal. We got it. We got to escape within 100 days. So let me explain just some things that we should probably know about this before we really get started. Number one, welcome to the slime area. This is basically the area where me and the other slimes live. If I try to leave this area and I am caught, uh, it's not gonna, oh God, he's already here. All right, which one of you is, is uh, goodness. Which one of you is offering yourself? This one? All right, <laughs> I'm gonna chop this one up. Nice and good. So yeah, you see why I wanna leave this place. I need to get out of here so I don't risk dying and getting killed by that maniac named Unicorn. Ah! So we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna start looking around this place to see if there's any sort of ways that we can find to escape It looks like unicorn is in that barn So we're gonna take this chance to quickly just open the front gate close it So he doesn't get suspicious and go this way perfect now We can start looking around the farm a little bit and starting to learn how this place operates first things first I need to see if there's any way to escape whether that be using a front gate or whatever Okay, there's this here. No, this appears to be a slaughterhouse the numbered building There is not the escape route. So this isn't it either. So we need to keep looking around there's got to be some sort of way to escape so if we look right here here is the gate that i have to destroy if i want to escape now there's one problem you're gonna notice i can try and break it not even leaving a mark that's because this is reinforced iron meaning the only way i can destroy this stuff is using an explosion which uh, obviously i can't do yet so i have to either find some sort of tnt or need to find something that's gonna let me blow up that gate so i can escape but i guarantee you that's not gonna be easy because i hired some of the best Best map makers out there to make this escape farm as hard as possible. So getting whatever I need to escape out that gate is not going to be easy and I'm sure it is hidden behind several different layers of security and hints and clues that I gotta find a way to bypass. For now, let's make our way back to the slime facility. Now that we know our way to escape, let's get a basic base set up for now and then we'll go from there. After my first day, I spent some time working on a basic survival base so I would have a place where I could organize my escape tools. After the base was complete, I tried to do some re and I really couldn't get out of the slime area without getting caught. And it is really bad if I get caught outside of the slime area, by the way. If caught, I am sent to one of seven slaughterhouses located on the farm. These slaughterhouses have insane challenges, all with the goal of killing me. So I have to be really, really careful not to get caught. <laughs> Hey guys, did you know we have a Discord server where you can hang out with us and other people in the community? Well, we do. Not only that, but you guys can now support us by using our Discord Nitro affiliate link. By clicking on the link on the top of the description, you will be able to purchase Discord Nitro, which directly supports our content. What do you get with Nitro? Rainbow Birds! <laughs> No, but seriously, Discord Nitro has tons of perks, including being able to customize your profile, stream HD video with friends, and even rainbow birds! So make sure to go ahead and grab yourself Discord Nitro by clicking the top link in the description down below. Okay, so now that our base is done, for the most part, let's just make our way over to Unicorn's house since it's time to start escaping, and let's be honest, anyone who's been watching these videos for a while knows for a fact that the first item Unicorn tends to hide usually is in his house. In the last one I did, 100 Day Iron Golem, turns out it wasn't the case, but I think it will be this time, so I don't see him around, so I'm gonna use this a chance to get over to his house. Now his house, it should be that building right there, and the reason I'm saying that is because it looks just like a house. Now I don't see Unicorn around, so I I think I'm okay. We're eventually gonna have to look around the rest of this place to see what the rest of these buildings are, but I'm gonna start with the house just because this tends to be where I first get stuff. Oh, he's right there. Ooh, I literally almost got myself caught. There's also like a basement back here, noted. What else do we have? Okay. Oh, he's coming, oh, he's coming. Oh, that was close, so close. Okay, let's get inside of the building. Okay, let's check up here. Um, I don't see anything useful, it's a lot of cabinets. So I'll check out these cabinets, but most of them have been empty so far. Nothing over here. We know there's nothing down there. So let's just check over this way. Nothing in this furniture, okay. Check these paintings out. Let me try hitting that button again, because I think this button may have done something. 
Oh, I did. Oh, I got something. Lab code and some potions. What is the lab code? 4765. Okay, is the lab his basement? There was a code right in front of his basement. 4765. No, so this must not be the lab. I don't know where the lab is, but I'm also not gonna... Why is Unicorn like really hot? Oh, he's in the guard tower. He's in the guard tower. Okay, we're gonna take this chance to actually go back to this main slime ranch area. I don't wanna risk getting caught already. So I'm gonna make my way back to the main slime area, not get myself caught here. And we are going to just look for this lab a different day because with Unicorn in that tower, I'm a little bit nervous. Let's, let's just get back in. After obtaining the code to the secret lab, I wanted to see if I could actually find the secret lab. So I decided to go out on a recon mission to learn what this farm had in it. First, I did find the secret lab. It has four different floors that all need to be unlocked by different codes and keys that I'll need to find around the farm. We then have Farmer Unicorn's house, a security building, several guard towers, and several other buildings as well. Now, with all of that information in mind, I finally have a game plan to get started. I need to sneak into the secret lab and see what this key opens. So so the other day when I was actually at the lab, I was about to put in the code when Unicorn showed up and literally didn't let me as I was exploring the lab. So I haven't actually gone to enter the code. I've been in this lab. I know where the code goes, but I haven't actually been able to use it. So today we're going to use the code and see what this is all about. So let me show you why I couldn't find this lab at first. The lab is actually hidden right down here. So you hit this button. You go in here, you go down this elevator and you are in a green room, big green slime room. And you're also gonna notice that there is three other elevators off to the side. So if I go up here to this one, we got some locked doors. It looks all nice and pretty. And you're gonna notice I have green lab access, which is gonna be this code here. I'd show you the other floors, but we're not worried about those right now because we only have access to the green lab. So 4765, we enter that code, it opens this door. And now this door is unlocked and open. So you're gonna notice we have two different things in here, a lava in infuser and a cloud infuser. Now, if I'm thinking about this right, if I step on this one, I should turn into a cloud slime. And if I step on this one, I should turn into a lava slime. So let's test the lava slime first. So we just back up onto this pressure plate. And there we go. I'm at like super low HP, but it seems to be healing. But you'll notice I am now a lava slime. Now the lava slime gives me different abilities that I'll quickly showcase. So with the lava slime, you'll notice right off the bat, I have fire resistance and I have lava vision, whatever that is. Also, as a lava slime, I get the ability to do slash lava, which will summon lava wherever I'm standing. So I'm gonna go ahead and put, just so I don't burn this room down, we'll quickly put four cobble around me. And I'm gonna go ahead and type slash lava and I should appear in lava. So slash lava. And look at that, I'm in lava. So now I can actually even see what my lava vision does. So you're gonna notice the lava is actually opaque so I can see through it. So that's my lava vision. So that's what the lava slime does. Now let's go quickly try out the cloud slime. So let's try the cloud slime. So we're gonna step up here, we're gonna back up onto it and we should become a cloud slime. And there we are. We are the cloud slime, a white slime that should get, oh my God, look how high I jump. So I gain the ability of jump boost four. And that's, I mean, that's the cloud slime. I can jump really high. So cool. So now I have two slimes, one who is a bouncy boy and one who can summon lava and apparently see through lava. Cause look how solid that looks now. That is crazy. Which honestly gives me an idea of what the rest of this facility must be about. I'm guessing the rest of this facility must be all about unlocking different slime powers. So let's go ahead and I'll quickly just run down the other floors and see if we can get any information now that we can use for later. So let's go on the red floor. Okay, this one's pretty straightforward. We can go in here. We can go this way. So we're gonna need, it looks like some sort of key card to open the red lab. And inside of the red lab, oh, I can't read it. Oh, I can't. I have no idea what that says. Oh, and there's no window. Oh, that's tough. Maybe if I put a block, like I don't have Optifine Zoom. Dang it. I have no clue what that says. So I don't know what it says. So it looks like there's probably two more slimes I can unlock in the next room. And then we'll go check the other floors as well real fast. Okay, then we have the blue floor. And on the blue floor, it looks like I can unlock some more slime. So I see a purple one and another one that's blue. But I once again, I can't really read them. So it's not... Wait, this one actually has a window. Hold up. Can I read this one? If I'm reading that right, that says diamond. And if I'm reading this one right, it says... I have no idea. Maybe obsidian? And it looks like to gain access to this one, I'm going to need something here. I don't know what that is. And then the, the last level of this lab is this floor right here. And this floor, there's no way in heck I can tell what I'm supposed to get. Like, what even is that? What is that thing? What even are you? Like, what are you? Are you gonna hurt me? Are we friends? 
I guess he doesn't want to hurt me. There's probably still stuff I need for that floor as well. But you can see there is still quite a few slimes I'm going to need to unlock if I want to find a way out of this play fun. Now, let's get out of here before we get caught. But that is basically a rundown of what the slime lab is and all the slimes I can unlock. Now, I'm going to go ahead and stay as the cloud slime for now. And then we're going to go ahead and see if we can find the key card to unlock even more slime. I found the secret lab and unlocked my first two slimes. I can now go through fire and lava without getting hurt when the lava slime is equipped. And I gain the ability to jump super high with the cloud slime. However, the second level of the slime lab needs to be unlocked by a key card. So I started to look for that key card around the farm. And so far, I haven't had any luck. Okie dokie. So we are going to now make our way over to the... <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is so annoying getting out of my cave with Cloud. It's so annoying. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and get out of this place really fast. And we're going to start making our way over to some of the other buildings that we need to start finding a way into. First being security. Okay, now we just need to see if there's a way inside. So usually... I need a code. Of, yeah, okay, so it looks like I need a code to get inside. So we're gonna have to find this code somewhere and then get... Ooh, unicorn. I see him. What is this? Can I... What even is this? I don't even know what this is. I'm gonna hide in it, though. What, oh, does he see hey, me? Oh, hey. he sees me. Oh, okay, move, 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 hey. move. Hold on. I got an idea. Jump. Oh, my God. Are we gonna get away with this? Where'd you go? <laughs> I saw you on my cameras. Come here. Oh, he, he did see me on the cameras. I knew... I told you we had to hide from those. Oh, he sees me. Oh, he sees me. Hey, he definitely sees me. Come down. Woo! This way. You this want, way. You want to meet no, I didn't want to fall. Boy. Uh, no, don't you. Actually, I think I'm a one. I think I'll die in one if he shoots me. You don't want none of this, boy. Uh, Do you understand me? Or is this another one where you don't understand stop me? Stop squishing around and let me talk. Okay, yep. He definitely thinks I'm just making squishing noises. Probably don't know how this works around here, but you're going to follow me. All right. So listen, little bad slimes like you could take to one of my, um, <clears throat> one of my other farm projects that I got going on around here. You understand? No, I don't. All right. So I'm going to shove you into one of them, and we get to see if you live or die. Okay, so it's it, he's bringing me to a slaughterhouse. Just to inform you, because I've had this problem in the past. I've had some uh, promiscuous mobs try to blow my facilities up, so we've gotten rid of the whole TNT thing altogether. Wait, there's no TNT? Don't TG? you go even look around. Wait, then how do I get out the front gate? I need to. So if that's what your objective was, <laughs> you might as well just stay inside your little pen. Anyway, boy. Uh, no TNT? <laughs> let's hope you don't end up a splat on the ground. <laughs> There you go. Okay. Don't end up a splat on the ground. Okay. First things first. If there's no TNT in this place, then I that, that's a first. Usually, there's always a way to get TNT, so I'm going to have to figure that out. But more importantly, I need to survive this slaughterhouse for now. So, it looks to be some sort of parkour of some kind. Now, this works out. I'm actually the jump slime, so I think I can actually cheat a lot of this away. Um, Let me see. Let's go over to this back corner real quick. This looks... If I'm going to be able to cheat, this is going to be the area to do it. Can I get up on this? Oh, my God. I did. Oh, my God. Look, I'm already up on... <laughs> Cheater. What? 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 Did I just get teleported back for cheating? Yo, in the past, I've cheated and I've never gotten teleported back. What is that nonsense? So he has removed my ability to cheat, which I think is hilarious. Hey, hey, go back to that. Uh-oh. Yep, here we go. All right, listen, Ryan. <laughs> yeah? I'll be real with you, team. All right, this whole course took probably about a day. So you're going to play it. You're going <laughs> to play it and you're going to stop cheating. I force me to play yes, through your I put a whole <laughs> bunch of effort into this. Me and my team, you're not going to squand dog it. <laughs> Okay, okay. I won't. I'll play through your map legitly. That's why I put the system in. It says cheater and everything. Why don't you try it again? That's why I have to come back. Okay. I did not expect him to break the fourth wall. Okay. So for those that don't know, yeah, Unicorn is the one who builds every one of these maps with his team, and he hates it when I cheat because I basically take hours of his work and throw it out the window. So for his sake, we won't cheat right now. Okay. So it looks like now right off the bat, this doesn't look like it would be cheating. I can just get up this ladder. Oh, I think I have to like jump in, jump in, go up here, jump to this slime. We get up here. Now we're at a tower. Now I don't have much health, so I can't take much fall damage. Oh, that's how he knows I'm cheating. I see him up there now. Go to. Oh my god, I got to the top of that tower in one jump. That's not cheating. Here we go. Oh, I'm still doing everything. In oh, oh, that almost killed me. If I took that second fall, I was dead. Okay, there we go. Go over here. We got a checkpoint of some kind, so I can climb back up. Okay, where are we going from here? Looks like we're going to this one, this one, to this one. Now this one I don't have the ability. But I guess I don't. Okay, there we go. Can I make that yet? Oh my god, I made it. What's even up here? What am I supposed to do up here? Am I going down to that slime? Let's try it. Here we go. Oh, we made it. I really hope that's what I was supposed to do. Am I supposed to like... I used that slime already. Am I using it twice? I'm gonna try it. It's worth a shot. Oh, that worked, actually. That did work. Jump to this one. Okay, you just gotta make this jump, and we'll be good. That's pretty tough. I don't like that. I might be able to make the brick, but I don't know if I want to risk it. This could definitely be a death here if I don't play my cards right. Oh, we did it. We're good. Now we're up here. Gotta make it to that brick now. I shouldn't die from this. 
Nice, we didn't. There we go. Another little ju slime jump. Oh, there we go. Double slime jumped it. And there we go. We're in this tunnel. Okay, I fall on the slimes. Okay, now I can just jump across this, but I think I'm supposed to slime jump across it. So let's just test it. Okay, I did both. Now, now I'm definitely not cheating. This one, I could just jump up to the ladder, but I think I got to use this to launch myself. And now I can go ahead and get myself up this. Now, oh, and then I see I'm going this way from here. Oh, I was doing it backwards before. I get it. Okay. Who? Wait, am I just bouncing out? Is that is that what I'm doing? I'm just bouncing out? Okay, here we go. Yahoo! Hoop, and we are free! I did it, Mr. Man in the tower, and I did it without cheating. Hey, good work. Good work down there. Listen, all right, get yourself oh, back on in the pen. He's back in character. Okay, well, let's go back to the pen. Okay, so it is going to be extremely, extremely difficult for me to get into that security room, especially with those cameras out front and me needing some sort of code. I don't know where this code even is, so I'm definitely gonna have to look around a little bit. Now, I haven't had much of a chance to even look around some of the close areas, like the barn and stuff, as I've been looking around in some more obvious stuff. So I wanna try some things. Like, number one, I haven't looked in any of these barrels. Seems like they're all empty. Uh, looks like there's a little, like, furnace here. I don't think this is anything, but I could I could also get lava vision and check just to make sure it's nothing. But I don't believe that's going to be anything. So, let's go get lava vision, double check that, and then if it's not in the barn, we're going to have to look around the rest of this place to see what we can actually find to see if there's any way into security or any other building, for that matter, that we might find around. So, let's hit this button. Go down. Okay, we'll go in here. Step on the lava slime thing. And there we go. We are a lava slime. So now we have our lava vision our, and our fire resistance and our slash lava command. All we need right now is the lava vision and the fire resistance to check out that lava pool just to make sure it's nothing. I don't think it's anything. I could be just wasting my time here, but you never know. So I'm going to check it regardless. Oh, it is weird losing my jump boost. And let's just double check. Make sure this is nothing. Oh, no. I think it is something. Oh, my God. Look, there's a hidden... Oh, there is something down here. In my lava vision. I needed the lava vision to do it. <gasps> what is this? This is so cool. I got to hit this now. Get on this ladder. Jump over. Jump over. Yes, we made it. There we go. We got another lab key card. Is this the key? I think this might be the key card I need to get the second level of stuff. Hold up. So let's go back. Let's go test this out at the lab and see what we can do with this. Okay, quickly hit the button. Quickly go down. So we'll just go over here real quick, put in the key card, and boom, we've unlocked the next two slimes. So let's see what they are. We have the camouflage slime, probably gonna turn me invisible. And then we have over here, the snow slime, which apparently I can use slash snow to generate snow on the go. So let's start out with snow slime here. Now here we go. And you'll see I'm the snow slime. I'm also getting snowballs really rapidly when stepping on that. On top of that, I also can become the camouflage slime. And you'll see I'm now invisible. For the next three minutes, I am invisible. And once per day, while the camo slime, I can actually use the ability slash camo, and it will turn me invisible for three minutes. But I can only do that once per day. Now that we have two new slimes unlocked, I'm actually going to go back upstairs and switch back into the cloud slime, just because I like the jump boost. And then we're going to make our way back to the slime ranch, work on some mining so we can get some armor, and then we're going to continue the hunt for a way to escape this place. After unlocking new powers for my slime, I can now jump from extreme heights without dying thanks to the snow slime, and I can even turn invisible with my new camo slime. This means I can finally get into the security room undetected from Farmer Unicorn Man and his security cameras. The only thing I need now is the code to get into security. And a cough drop. My voice is really strained right now. So it's officially day 25. We are a quarter of the way through this challenge. My iron is almost done. So we can finally get some iron armor upgrades. And now we are actually a little bit safer. So let's go back up to the crafting table. And there it is. So now we're going to quickly craft the iron armor. Boink. Looks like we have five extras. We can make a shield probably and some tools and a sword and all that jazz, but that's good enough for now. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead from here and see if we can finally get into security because now that we have access to some better slimes, like ones that can turn invisible, getting in is going to be no problem. We just need to find the code to actually get in there. So there's only a few places that could be that's either going to be in Unicorn Man's house or it could be in other places as well. I'm going to make my way over to his house and start checking it out one last time just to make sure I'm not missing the code in there or anything like that uh, and if it's not there i'm probably just gonna have to start looking around this whole facility because uh, at that point i'm pretty dumbfounded okay what could i be missing here there's buttons on the floor that button doesn't do anything there is a locked room back here but i can't kind of looks like a kitchen almost when jumping up and down and then up here this is just his bedroom i didn't see anything in here I, oh god he's here gotta hide gotta hide gotta hide oh where am i gonna hide uh jump up here jump oh i can't make the jump those are fences up uh, <laughs> He may not notice if I just, if I'm in the open. No way! 
Oh my god, I'm getting away with it. I need him to leave. Oh, he's coming, he's coming. What the heck was... Oh, he heard me drinking. Oh no. Don't move. Hello? There's no what? way. What? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, the table decoration. You're no lava lamp. Get down from there. Oh, that's a good one. A lava lamp. I didn't even think about that. Get down from there. Come on. You can't just go snooping around in some guy's house. That's what you got your own pen for. That's it. Come with me. Yep, here we go. Okay, we're going to slaughter two. Here we are. Oh, here's two. Now, uh, it's pretty regular that I get a couple of bad eggs around here. So, you'll be facing off against your counterpart slime here. Save well, your loads. Is that, that, is that a cloud or is that a snow slime? Real. Oh, I can tell by your inquisitive wiggle that you're asking what kind of slime this is. No. no uh, this okay. is a snow slime. Okay, good. As long as it's not a jump slime. All right. Now, listen, okay? We're going to have a little race here. Three lap round, okay? First one to pass this finish line after three laps gets to live. The other one, well, let's just say I haven't uh, gotten to use this thing yet. <laughs> so I'm ready for it. Okay, well, we got to start on the right side of the starting line. Wait, which way are we going? Hey, you're facing the wrong yet yeah, that way. Oh, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I was going to go the wrong. I was going to go backwards. All right. On my mark. Get set. Go, go, The go. gunshot means go. Oh, I see. We're supposed to slime jump that. I did not see that coming. Okay, here we go. Slime jump. Yes. Okay, we did it. We can go around the slime jump this time. Okay, here we go. What do we got here? Oh, I totally whiffed it. We're going to go across the soul sand now. Oh, hopefully that doesn't mean that other guy's going to catch up. There we go. Go, 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 go. Go, self. What? Oh, there's blockades. We got to go around them. Jump. We got lily pads. I can do lily pad jumps. There we go. Okay, they're right behind me. What is this? Does that give me speed boost? I think it gave me... Oh, some of them give speed. Some give slowness. Go, go, go. Keep going. Okay, that's lap one. There's two. Okay, what do I got to do for this? I don't understand this. What am I supposed to do to do this? Maybe I have to go that long route the other time to make that work. Okay, we'll jump across the soul sand. Leap, leap. Jump. We're just going. We're going all the way. We're going all the way. We're going quick. We're going quick. It worked. Where's the other slime? Oh, he's way behind. He's way behind. We got room. We got room. Okay, we got the speed boost. Just jump over the rest. There we go. Oh, yes. Oh, lava slime is red hot. And the snow one's getting cold feet. Jump. <laughs> Nailed these two. Let's try this one. Let's try this one. Maybe this one gives me jump boost. Oh, it gives me speed. Does that make it possible? Oh my God. I heard him climb the ladder. He's right behind me. I missed that cool walkway every time and I'm disappointed in myself, but I think I still win. Yeah. Oh my God. He's right behind me. We still win though. Once, twice, three times. Come and in hot. Go! Oh, and we got ourselves a winner. Well, how, how do you feel about winning this competition, Mister? I'd like to. I'd like to thank. Um... Yeah, nobody cares. <gasps> okay. All right, get back to your pen. Yeah, okay? no, yeah, I'll do that. Unless you want to get shot. Yeah, no, I'm gone. Bye. Okay, so I still have found literally nothing at all. I've looked everywhere. I haven't looked down here yet. Okay, all there is is this white slime. Can I do anything with you? Can I right-click you, maybe? Uh, hi. I'm hiding here because I'm a really weak slime. One hit, and I'm toast. Do you think you could help me? If you can get me a golden apple, it would really save my life. I don't think I have time for a mission to get you a golden apple. I'm sorry. I, I need to find... I gotta find a security code. I guess I can give you the security code, though I don't think it's that useful. Yeah, what do you mean it's not useful? Yes, it's useful. Okay, I'll get you the golden apple, but I need that security code when I'm done. I'll be back. I'm getting you that golden apple now. Okay, it was literally right under my feet. It was right next to the slime thing the whole time. That's kind of annoying, but also probably should have saw that coming. Either way, we figured out. I just need to go mining, get enough gold to make a golden apple, and we should be good to go. Luckily, I found a slime in a cave right next to the slime ranch that is also trying to escape. They made a deal with me that if I can find them a golden apple, they will give me a code to the security room. I spent days and days looking around the ranch for golden apples, and I even tried crafting my own, but I couldn't find enough gold ore around the farm to make one. So my assumption is there must be a hidden golden apple somewhere on this farm. I just have to find it. Okay, I've literally had no luck finding any gold and it has been days i found i went through all the caves there's no gold there's literally no gold like anywhere so crafting this golden apple is going to be impossible so i have a new plan to start checking out some areas i haven't been but it's gonna require okay unicorns in the barn exiting he's exiting go back inside okay well he starts walking i want to see if i can get into his back room in his house i gotta be quick about this i'm gonna run to the factory the, i mean the lab i'm gonna switch over to a camo slime be invisible and try and sneak into his house and get into that locked room to see if there's anything back there. Okay, this building's still open. We gotta be very quick. So we go down here. We need to go all the way over here. 
We're gonna be very quick about this. Here we go. Camo slime. Step on this. Go back. And now we are a camo slime. We're invisible for three minutes. We're gonna use this initial three minutes of invisibility. Then we're gonna use slash camo. And then with slash camo, we'll get an additional three minutes. So let's go back to the top. Okay, we're invisible. Oh, he's coming down. Oh, careful. Just don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Okay, he didn't notice. Okay, he went in his kitchen. Quick. Didn't notice. Can I sneak in? Whoop. Oh my god, I'm in his kitchen. Let's go, dude. Is there anything in here? <gasps> god apples. Three god apples. We got three god apples. Okay, we just need to get out. When he exits, we're gonna take this chance and exit. Doing some stuff. Second he exits, we're gone. Did he notice his golden apples were missing? He's going. He's going. Yeah, exit, exit, exit. Okay, just need to wait for him. Can't open that door yet. Let him go upstairs or something. Yeah, that works. Gone. Go. Book it and we're gone. The invisible slime saves the day. I knew it. I knew there was a kitchen, so there might have been golden apples. So we got the golden apples. Let's quickly bring them to the slime. In fact, we only have to give him one. He asked for a singular golden apple. So I'm going to keep two of these. I'm going to give one to this slime and he should give me the code to security. Here you go. Take that. Thank you. Here's the code. Okay, we got the guard room code. What is it? Are you kidding me? The code is one, two, three. Okay, I guess the code is one, two, three. Really, really good code there. Let me tell it. That is the that is that is the best security code I've ever heard in my life. We're in. Okay, anything I can access. I don't see anything. Okay, we're going to second floor. Oh, there's a spawner. There's a spawner. Okay, we got a room here. Oh, this is full of cabinets. Okay, no, 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 no. Oh my god, there it is. Yes, the camera monitor. Oh my god, our invisibility is gone though. Okay, we have access to the cameras. The unicorn can't use them anymore. We have his camera monitor. Is there any other way to get down? I'm gonna be very careful about this. Wait, what's over here? There's something else over here. What is this? Oh god, where's unicorn? I lost him. Hopefully he's not coming this way. Crazy man scribble. Oh, he's on the tower. Get down. Okay, we're gonna have to use slash camo if we're gonna get out of this. Here we go. I'm gonna do slash camo. Slash camo. Okay, did I get it? Okay, I'm invisible for three minutes. We're good to go. Now I just need to get down without him seeing me. Here we go. Jump on this slime. That almost killed me. That's fine. We got down. We'll take this chance. Grab the camera monitor. Get out of here. And then we'll read the crazy man scribbles once we get to a little bit safer of a spot. Okay, we're back in the slime pen. So let's go ahead. Let's take a peek at what these scribbles say. I buried something. Something weird. Boss told me to get rid of it. I did. I buried it. Where? Where did I bury it? I remember it was close to the wall behind behind the scarecrow. There, that's where I hid it. That that makes no sense um, at all. I know I'm invisible. Well, either way, that makes no sense to me. I'm going to make my way to the slime lab, quickly change back into a cloud slime, and then I'm going to come back here and start working on piecing together this riddle. Okay, so I think I've kind of figured out what I have to do from this point if I'm gonna solve the crazy man scribbles. So it says that I basically have to follow this behind the scarecrow near the wall. That's really like the two major hints that are part of this. So we're gonna run around the wall and look for a scarecrow because that's literally all I have to go on. Okay, nothing yet. And I'm safe to run around because Unicorn is... He doesn't have access to the security cameras. Also, is the pumpkin with a sea pickle meant to be the, the thing? This looks pretty scarecrowy. Okay, let me read the book again. I found a scarecrow. Oh, behind the scarecrow. Okay, I'm going behind the scare. How far back behind the scarecrow do I gotta go? Oh, well, this is a very suspicious looking X. Aha! Old circuit, there we go. Oh, I bet you this is what I need to unlock the next set of slimes. There were those three blocks. I bet you I need three circuits. Oh my God, and I got the first one. Okay, well, let's go put this down. And I think we only need two more after that. Let's quickly get down here. Okay, down, down, down. Go into the blue room. Yeah, look, I can put a circuit there and then there's just two more I need and I could open there. So I just need to find two more circuits and I can get more slimes. We are making progress. Do I have any idea how I'm gonna blow up the front gate yet? Not a clue, but I'm sure I'll figure that out with time. I found the first circuit. Now I just need to find two more. However, there are no leads to where they might be except for maybe Farmer Unicorn's basement, which is locked by a code. It's the only locked door I know about that I haven't opened yet. So my next objective is to find that code. But first, I looked around the farm for a few days looking for anything hidden, but I couldn't find anything. I'm thinking maybe the guard towers have something hidden with them because it isn't like our map makers to put something in for no reason. Okay, so I want to check out the guard towers simply because it's one of the few areas I haven't checked out yet, and I gotta find the code to the basement somewhere. I've checked everywhere else. There is nowhere else. Oh, is that unicorn? Oh my god, he's up on that tower. Oh, hide, 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 hide. Okay, I want to check out this tower. I want to get to the top because there, sometimes sometimes he, he hides stuff in weird spots like that. Or we can go around the back here. Jump up here. Oh, there's a spawner. Oh, God. It's day, though. I don't think these can spawn during the day. Yeah, there's nothing up here. Oh, wait, wait. What was that? What was that? Hello? 
Oh, a little latch area. Okay, let's go check the other towers out and see if they have the exact same thing. Okay, there's another guard tower over this way. <gasps> this one's open. This one's open. This one's not covered up. Okay, we're in. Okay, what is in here? Cobwebs and carrots. More carrots, carrots, carrots. Oh, I'll take the cooked pork chop. Well, I can come back here if I need food. This is good enough for now. What's this? It's a secret. The towers have shifted slightly. What does that even mean? This one was locked a second ago. Is it unlocked now? <gasps> oh, it is. Okay, wait. Now, if we go around back, okay, it's different. Every in the inside's different of this one. Oh, that looks wrong. I think there's a gap right there. Yeah, there is. Okay, wait, another tower shifted slightly. Hold up. Okay, he's in that tower right there. Go around back this way. Quickly sneak down to the basement. Where is it? 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 Please. Oh, it worked. Okay, we're in. We're in the basement. Please don't come down here. Oh, wait, there's the button. Wait, that, that made, oh my God, there's an another secret. It was a double secret. Now there's only one more. Is he still up there? He's coming down. Okay, I gotta be careful. Let's hide for a sec. Climb out of this, and now we gotta get to that last tower, which I think was back this way. Okay, and we're at the tower. So let's just jump on this little side. Oh, God, there's barriers. Okay, this is open now. We're looking for a button. Some sort of button. Oh, my God, we got something. Basement code. Oh, we have the basement code. Oh, there's no button down here, because I think this is it. I think we finished the puzzle. Okay, now we're just gonna turn this code in over to the basement, and we are finally in the unicorn's a basement and that's gonna be really beneficial because that is going to give us a massive massive advantage going forward okay so we'll just go this way up around the side of unicorns house -aru. I don't hey oh no I was literally just about to say I don't see him anywhere and I saw him please make it on the roof no yeah I would stay right where you were boy right where you were as is boy come on <laughs> Look at that. Why do you gotta make that <laughs> nauseating sound? Ugh. <laughs> I hate it too, but I'm gonna keep doing it because he complains Gross. about it every time. All right, come here. Look, you're gonna you're gonna be snooping so close to home while while I put you in one of my slaughterhouses close to home. What do you think of that? This one's designed to get a good splat out of you. Oh, look at that! I fit through your little trap. Uh. Yeah, you're <laughs> going through. <laughs> Don't you come out unless. You Right, we, we had this discussion about cheating, please. Yeah, okay. Well, okay. <laughs> now you stay now you stay in there and you you live or you die. You know how this works, alright? Stop oh. laughing. Stop slam laughing. <laughs> okay, um, I'm in a dropper. I hate dropper. Well, let's give it a go. Here we go. I see slime. I see slime. I see slime. Oh my god, I see what I have to do. I have to use the slime to bounce to the next dropper. Now I should actually get over here. Yes. Okay, we did it. We did it. We did it. Now what's this one? I likely have to teleport my way back. Oh wait, no, no, I could have made that. Oh my god, I did make it. I still made it. I double made it. Up, up, up we go. Press here to continue. Oh dear lord. We bounce. Oh wait, wait, I, I got an idea. Go for this. Can I get back up? Oh my god, we got back up. I see a button. Please escape. Boop. Oh, All that right, was wait. fast. That was really fast. Hmm. Did that a little faster than anticipated. Yeah, you did. Well, because you did it so fast, you probably didn't learn your lesson, did you? What does that mean? You didn't learn any lessons here. You, you figure, you know, you just get tossed in the house and you get out. So yeah, that's what normally happens. We're, we're tossing you in the solitary so that you know exactly what you've done and you can think about it. What? What is All solitary? Right? Come on, you're going to slime solitary. Okay, what is this? This is solitary, the cage? All right, you're you're in timeout time. Yeah, not even your little jumping powers are going to get you out How now. long am I even stuck in here for? <laughs> all right, hang out in there for 10 whole days. Are right? you kidding? No, that's baloney. Learn your lesson. Don't go snooping around. How do I even? Is there? Maybe I can jump boost my way. I don't think there's any way out of here. I really don't think there's any way. I'm actually going to be stuck in here for 10 days. This is stupid. After running out of time in the third slaughterhouse, Farmer Unicorn Man sent me to solitary for 10 days. Luckily, I found a hidden room, but it seems to require a lever. I'll need to find that lever as fast as possible and get back to solitary to open it. I have less than 50 days now, so I'm really going to have to hurry if I want to beat this challenge. Okay, so it's officially day 52. I'm supposed to be out of here, but I haven't been let out yet. I'm going to keep hopping around until I get let out. Oh, hey, there he is. You going to let me out? I've been, I've been watching you hop around for like five minutes. Kind of hilarious. I'm free. All right, little buddy. Now, you got to do me a favor and stop escaping. All right. Come on. Back to your pen. Okay. Yeah. Let me totally go back to my, let's go back to my pen. We're back in here. This is where he thinks I'm going to stay, but obviously we're going right back out and right to his basement. So let's go here. Okay. He's making his way back to his house too. 
But we're right on his tail because I'm using this basement code today. Let's get around to the back here. I'm not even going to walk in front of the house. I'm going to literally walk all the way around. Let's put in the code. It is 811818. There we go. And we're, oh, that's lava. Okay, to get past that, I'm going to need the lava slime. To the lab. We're changing to a fire slime. We can see through the lava now. There's a room back here. Oh my God. We got a full enchanting station. There's the circuit. We also have a bunch of weapons and shields and all sorts of stuff. Okay, let's get out of here before we get caught. Let's go back around the side this way. And let's go back to the lab, put the circuit in its place, and then all we have to do is start looking for a third circuit. And that could literally be anywhere. For all we know, that's what's in solitary. So it could that's that could be what's there. But either way, we're gonna make our way back to the lab, switch back into a cloud, and also put this circuit where it belongs. Second circuit in place. Now to go turn into a cloud and then make my way back to the slime pin and we'll continue tomorrow trying to find the rest of the stuff. After getting the second circuit, there was only one area left that needed to be unlocked. And that was the hidden area inside of solitary. So I needed to find a special lever that would open whatever was hidden inside of there. The question is, where is the lever though? So I've been looking for quite a few days at this point for the lever into solitary and I have not found a thing like not a thing i've checked the towers i've checked underground the towers i've literally checked in every single slaughterhouse at this point except for the ones i haven't been to and if it's in one of those i probably can't get into it yet but i want to keep looking because it's got to be somewhere if it's in one of those slaughterhouses so be it i can't get it yet but there's nothing else i can do during that time as that's literally the only thing left that i think i can open that looks fishy i want to go check that out there's iron bars in this tree over here what is this we got a little lever oh there's a slime in here hi buddy Oh my god, the slimy lever. Place on iron block. Oh my god, you're a legend. I don't even, I don't have chat on. So if you're talking to me, I'm sorry. I gotta go get myself caught. Where was Unicorn? I think I saw him in solitary. Or no, sorry. I think I saw him over there at security. And let's get ourselves caught by Unicorn so we can be sent to the next slaughterhouse. In fact, let's start destroying stuff. And maybe he'll send me to solitary for just destroying the place. Because I want to make him as mad, mad as possible. Because I gotta get sent to solitary. He's gonna start breaking windows. Oh my god, wait. It doesn't even make a glass break sound. Here we go. What? He noticed. Excuse Hey, Whoop. come down. Calm down. Excuse me. Gotta go. <laughs> Come. <coughs> oh, he's shooting. Okay, he's mad. He's mad. Okay, we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back. You think you're so funny. <laughs> yeah, dude, I do. You think you're absolutely hilarious. I am hilarious. Well, let me let me give you some news, boy. You're not. You're a nuisance. Now, I'm taking you one of my specially designed houses i should really hire a landscaper right? who dug up the bottom of my was this you two get in the maze oh get here it is maze. it's time for the big maze oh i, love I got it. more for you when you get back okay let's go this way okay luckily the mobs don't spawn during the day so i picked a good time to get caught for this stop i don't mean to cheat i'm not trying to cheat that time i promise okay looks like there's something up this way okay we're in a room okay yeah yeah it's an invisible parkour type room i think we're supposed to go this one to this one to the ladder, which is a single block. To this ladder, which is also a single block. And we're getting on this one, the dark blue. Now this ladder. Okay, I'm on top of the maze. I gotta jump to that corner, I think, and somehow get that chest. Here we go. First try. Ready? Here we go. Oh my god, I got it. Did I actually get it? 1996. I was so fast I was able to grab that paper. Now we just need to go to the other side of the maze. Yeah, here we go. Now we're making some progress. Okay, this should just bring me out. Yeah, this brings me over this way, which brings me over here. Is this the entrance? Whoa, it's a fan. Oh, that's so cool. Can I get in it? Oh, I got to keep running with it. Oh, I see. Oh, if it touches me, I think I might die. Okay, don't let it touch me. I don't want to die. Go. Hey, we did it. We got another code. Okay, we got three codes. Now, what do I do with these? Okay, we exited the fan of death. Now, we got to figure out where to bring these codes. Is there like an entryway? I bet we have to go back to the number four, maybe. Oh, wait, no, maybe it's, or maybe it's that tower over there. There is that tower over there. Let's go check out the tower. And we go over here. Oh, that's the wrong way. Let's do that. There we go. Okay, code one was 1996. That didn't work. Okay, that didn't work. What other codes do we have? 0372. There we go. 1996. There we go. And what was the last one? 2532. And there we go. And we are out. Oh, I'm sorry. That's an alligator. I, I, I don't recall having alligators on this farm, sir. <laughs> that scared me so much. That, that wasn't planned, I swear. Um, now, listen. Oh, my goodness. Listen. All right. You did a good job getting through that maze. I know I did. Except for the part where you cheated. I barely jumped. I barely used I the I saw you cheating all over the walls. I saw you cheating all over the It was like minor. I, it would just save me like a few seconds. I didn't. Hey. Hey, here's the wall. Here's the wall. And then this was you. Okay. Okay. Look. Look. Am I or am I wrong? You're you know right. what? You don't even, even got to respond because I can't understand slimes. Follow oh. me. 
<laughs> What's happening now? Wait, what? You're going to solitary. Oh, I that's forgot. Fine. That's what I, I wanted. I forgot about that. I I completely forgot about trying to get into solitary. Well, that worked that's out. Not even to mention the damage you've done to my beautiful guard building. Oops. You're going away for a long time. Ten days specifically. Okay, cool. We're back in solitary. Now we can actually test out what this does. So that's fine. I'm cool with being in here for a few days while I get this progress because can't really move on without getting in here. So here we go. Put this down. Didn't seem to do anything. I, got, I mean, I gotta try something because... Oh! Wait, either this... No, yeah, there's a door. This just opened. Boom! We got the last circuit. Boom! We got the last circuit. Now we just have to wait till we, we get out of here in like 10 days. Um... So, well, at least we got the circuit. Yay! I was able to get back into solitary and find the last circuit. But I have to stay here for 10 days again. I have less than 30 days left before my big escape. And I still have two floors to unlock. I really, really hope I can beat this challenge. Okay, so we're out of solitary. Nice and easy. Got out yesterday. And now we can finally put the third circuit in its place. Get the new slimes. Find out what we're going to get here. And then we can go from there to see what the last few slimes we unlock are. So here we go. Put it in place. Hit the button. And boom, we're in. So it looks like we've officially unlocked the obsidian slime and the diamond slime. So we have two different slimes. Let's go and let's try the diamond slime first. And we are now the diamond slime. You're going to see we get strength one and resistance one with the diamond slime. So that's good. So I get a strength bonus and a damage reduction bonus, and it looks like I actually have more HP as a diamond slime, so that's also a benefit. Let's try the obsidian slime out real quick. With the obsidian slime, you'll notice, oh god, I'm really slow, so it looks like I have slowness too, but I get strength too and resistance too, so I can kind of pick between more HP, more resistance, and more strength at the disbenefit of slowness, or a little bit less powerful with the diamond. I'm gonna go with the diamond one for now, and now let's go ahead and let's head to the fourth floor and find out what we need to unlock the last of the slimes. Because I'm assuming at this point, whatever slimes are left have got to give me the ability to escape. They've got it. I don't know what else they could be, so... Let's go check this out and see if we can figure this out. So we'll go in here. Right, I forgot. This one doesn't like it doesn't work the same. It's like a parkour. Okay, so there's like a, a gap in the jump that I can't. So I can't make that jump. I bet with the cloud I could. But it looks like there's a bunch of missing ones. Are they different colors? Oh, they are different colors. I bet you there's missing stuff here I need to find. Let me try something real quick. Hold on, what's that? Is that supposed to be up there? Hold up, can I read? Oh, I can't read you. Oh, no, I can. What is that? There we go. Got it. What is that? Lab slime. Place on green concrete. Green concrete. Well, this is the green concrete. Got you. I think these are slime blocks to help me bounce my way through the parkour. Now, with this cloud, I actually have the advantage of being able to bypass some of that. So, like, red. I can skip. That stops working when we get up here to blue. It's a ceiling jump. So I actually jumped too good to finish that. So we do need to find the slime blocks. And it looks like there's different slimes around that I'm going to have to find and color coordinate. How many more do I need? So we need three more slimes in total for us to unlock whatever is beyond this gate. And hopefully that lets us escape because we are running out of time and I still have no explosives to blow up the front gate and get out of here. So we are almost in the last 25 days. We technically have 27 days remaining. We're gonna go ahead and quickly head back out and we're gonna transform into some different slimes because usually as I unlock slime powers, I have to use those slimes to then get whatever's next. So I'm gonna switch into probably the diamond slime and that way I don't get the slowness. And hopefully that gives me the ability to unlock whatever slime blocks are next because we have to go looking around for these slime blocks and I don't know where they are. So let's head down and there we go. We are a diamond slime. So now we just need to make our way back up to the surface and start seeing what we can figure out with the diamond slime that may come in handy. So let's go up to the top. Now we just need to find, well, really any leads we can. So as an example, I could go into- Hey, oh, little fella. I could go into you security. Know, who's that tiny blue slime? Stop him. Now what do you think you're doing around here, you little blue slime? You, you know, you're one of the rarest ones in the bunch, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Listen, come come follow me. I don't get a lot of chances to test on uh, on blue slimes, all right? I hear that you're hardy fellas, okay? So I'm going to toss you into my little combat arena. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put some promiscuous bad guys towards you. And you're going to kill them until I feel I'm pleased with my testing results. All right, we're going to start you off simple, boy. Oh, hey, zombies. I didn't even hear them spawn. Oh, and a skeleton. Hold up. There we go. Easy yeah. street. Yeah, you're pretty good. I got this like shield. This. What does this shield do? Okay, it just has a lot of... Oh, wait. Shield bash. Block and left click. Hold on. I got to try this. Oh, I can hit people with my shield. Oh, but then it, it becomes unfunctional for a sec. Oh, now the mobs are starting to stack. Hold up. Gather them all up. Let's go. 
Everyone gather around the creeper. Okay, the skeletons are fighting each other. That works. Whack them once, whack them twice. Dead. Spiders have actually been the most challenging so far. I think because my height. All right, all right. Come on out. Come on out. Okay, let me quickly heal up these bows together. I said come out. I'm coming. All right, that was pretty sufficient. You're, you're one tough nut, but trust me. You can't, you can't stop this bad boy. You don't want to deal with this. Now, if I catch you outside your pen again, it's Vamoose, buddy. I'm pretty sure that's Spanish for dead. Okay. After defeating all those mobs in the slaughterhouse with my diamond slime powers, I continued looking for different colored slime blocks for the next few days. I've already found the lime block, so I still have to find the red, the blue, and the dark green. There are still many areas left to cover on the farm, so it could literally be anywhere, including outside the farm or even underground. Okay, we are in the last 20 days. And I'm starting to get nervous because I only have one slime block to show for it. I want to check out a few more areas like there was down this way in these farms. I haven't actually looked through the farms more than a few seconds. And it wouldn't, I wouldn't put it past. Unicorn to hide something in these that's just like hidden. No, I'm definitely crazy. Never mind. There's nothing there. Okay, mission Abolo. Mission, uh, mission failed. We'll check the cave real quick. I think I already got something. Wasn't there a slime down here I talked to earlier? Yeah, there was a slime like right here I talked to earlier. This is just a wall, unless this is something. <gasps> it is! There's a whole minecart back here. I think I'm supposed to hit the button, but that's not. Okay, there we go. Booyah! Dude, there we go. We got, a, we got place on red concrete. We got another one. We literally have another one. And that means we only need two more slimes and we're out of here. If I can find the next two slimes in, what, under 20 days? Well, no, no, that doesn't mean I escape. We don't know what's past it yet. I'm making a big assumption, actually, that I, I can get out once I get past this step. But there's no guarantee on that. Now we got to put this on the red concrete. Which one's red? That's green. That's red. There we go. And let's go find two more. So I'm stuck. I don't know where any of these slimes are. And it's really getting annoying. I want to make sure there's nothing in my pin I'm missing. No slimes I can talk to in here. Did you talk to me? No. Do you talk to me? No. Wait. You don't have a name above your head. Do you talk to me? Yes, you do. Have you checked under any of the slime piles around the farm? Tons of stuff gets lost under those. I would definitely take a look. You're a legend. Thank you. Somewhere under the slime piles, there might be something. That's the hint the slime gave me. Okay, so we'll go up here and we're just gonna start checking out because there are slime piles actually everywhere. Yeah, there's one up here, which they're right. Technically, there was something in this slime pile. So we know the tower slime piles definitely aren't it. So we need to look at some other slime pile. I think there's one near security. Yeah, there's definitely... Oh, yeah, yeah, I see one near security. Let's go to security. Okay. Okay, slime. Anything underneath the slime pile? No, it seems to literally just be a pile of slime. Okay. Ooh. Did he see me? Does he see me? I can't tell. Oh, yeah. He's looking right at me. You gonna come down? I, I didn't think... I, it was one of those situations where I couldn't see you, so I didn't think you could see me, but you definitely um, saw you, me. You, you disgust me. That's not nice. You slimy cube, you. Ugh. All right. You think you're so smart? Walking around. Yes. Doing your own thing. Yes. All right. Well, let's just see how smart you are. Get all in, partner. Insert slime <laughs> keys here. I don't have any slime keys. All right. Well, you best get figuring out or, uh, I don't know, die oh, or something. I'm going to figure this out. Let's get up here and let's take a look at an overview of this puzzle. Okay, so here's what I think I'm supposed to do. I think those two buttons, uh, they they did something, I don't know what, but it was probably helpful. Oh, wait, what is this? <gasps> Whoa. I'm trying it, here we go. Ah! Oh, I made it, I made it. What's this? Slime key, okay, that's one of the slime keys that I need to bring to that chest. And what's over here? Is it, This is definitely a puzzle of some kind. I get it, I know what I'm doing. I'm pushing this armor stand to the right spot. I push it, it lands there. Push it to there. Oh God, I gotta push it all the way back here. And now I'm be pushing it into water. Is that gonna work? Oh my God, it did. I didn't even know that was a thing. What does this do? What? That was so cool, it went flying. And we scored. Yeah, there we go. Now we got two slime keys. So let's bring these back over this way. Okay, I just noticed something. Okay, so the tower door just opened. That tower door is now open. We need to go back across this. This part is parkour. Of course, those open the wrong way. There we go. What's in the chest? Nothing. It's a troll chest. Oh, I see. I need it for the height. Here we go. Bounce here. Bounce here. Please. Oh, thank goodness. Can I make that? I don't even know if I can make this. I have to try, though. Oh, my God. We can. I didn't think I could make it. Here we go. We did it. Oh, there's a button. I was like, where's the... Is there a button? There is. Okay, we climb this. And now it looks like we're just climbing a tower. This is easy. I can do this. There's a barrel. Place on slime. Oh! oh, it worked. Oh, hey! Is there hay? Oh, that's what this is for. Boing. Oh, I think he's gone. He's just not here. Okay, I'll take that. Well, we escaped. So we're going back to the slime thing because I don't want to 
risk getting caught again. But I'm going to continue looking through slime piles tomorrow and see if we can find any sort of thing that could help any sort of slime or anything. We're going to find it tomorrow. After completing the slaughterhouse, I spent a few days searching under, over, and in different slime piles around the farm. However, there are so many slime piles. I need to find both colored slime blocks before the 15 days are up, or I am trapped in this farm forever. Okay, so we got to go back up, and we got to keep looking through slime piles and see what we can find, because there is still a bunch I haven't looked through, and that is a lot of time I got to spend, so we got to keep cracking away at these so basically the last one i went through was back there so we're gonna keep going around this way check around six check around unicorn's house check around uh slaughterhouse three and see if we can find any on this side uh, i see that one right there we'll go back though i want to just check this back corner first and then we'll check that slime pile that's next to unicorn's house so let's go into his house and see or what we can find in this slime pile so let's break a bunch of these nothing oh i thought that was something i got so excited for a sec there what? No, it is something. That's such a big fall. I won't survive that. Even as a diamond, I won't survive that. I'm pretty sure the snow one gives me feather falling. I, I could be wrong on that. I haven't really used snow that much, but I think it gave me feather falling. There we go. We're officially snow. And it obviously dropped us a bunch of snowballs, but we don't need those. So let's go ahead. Let's go back. And now I should have slow falling too. Okay, I didn't realize I had slow falling with this the first time I used it. I know I have slow fall, but I don't know how much damage that's going to reduce. So I may eat a gapple before going. No, I won't. I'm going to fall. Cool. What is this? We got a painting. Can we get behind it? Oh my God, I can. But there's a locked door behind it. Okay. Bookshelves, barrels. We got an eight, a two, a six, a one. I have eight, two, six, one right now. Let's try it. No way that worked. It was literally the exact number I found it. So I get a bow and a bunch of arrows from this. And now I can shoot this pressure plate. Got it? What just opened? I heard something open. Oh, these iron doors. We got through. Is there anything in here? What's this? <gasps> yes, we got it. We got it. We got it. We got the one for the blue concrete. We got the next slime. It brought us into one of the guard towers. Okay, now that we have that, let's go quickly get back to the place. Let's bring the slime there, put it in its place. And I think after that, we should only need one more slime okay we place this one on the blue concrete which is this one right here and now we only have one slime block left to obtain for the dark green area and we will be able to find out what the final slimes we unlocked are which is good because we are starting to really run out of time okay so let's go down here let's grab some of our stuff and then I only, I, I'm, I'm really slow as obsidian so we're going to change back over to diamond so we can move around a little bit top speed let's grab some of our slimy soups let's go change into a diamond one let's also go while we're there i believe there was an enchanting table there i'm so slow where was the enchanter anyway wasn't it like down here or something it was in one of these wasn't it perfect we're in here's the enchanter okay so let's oh i don't have lapis well that's not good. is there lapis in here there's blueberries how is there blueberries and not lapis in an enchanting room that is ridiculous well that was pointless okay well let's just go change over to the diamond slime then and we'll go from there. Oh, uh, whoa, whoa, uh, oh, oh, hey, why are you walking away from it? Okay, away. what are you doing wandering around here? Uh, I was about to go turn into a diamond slime, but uh, that's not happening. Listen, don't don't answer that. I, I'm I'm disappointed in you. That's why I'm using the D word. Follow me. Let's all grab. right, big boy. Okay, here we go. Oh, what's up hey, with all the bones? I want you to put on a big show for me, ladies and gentlemen. Big skeleton. Yup, there he is. I knew it was going to be a boss. Let's go, dude. Wait, let me drink a potion of strength. Hold on. I can do more damage. I can do more damage. Let me get him with this hammer, too. I think the battle hammer does more. Let's see if we can get him. Oh, that did a boatload. We need the regen. We need the regen, though. Oh, we did a lot. That does a lot, but we're also oh, it's hurt. it's a good fight. It's a good fight out there. Oh, my God. We're doing so much. Go, 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 go. Come on. One more. One more. Oh, oh. yes. We were so low. I was on three hearts. Oh, he exploded into little bony bits. Oh, my goodness. Oh my god. Oh. I hit three hearts. Wow. Oh. Oh, you are an impressive little slime. Here, come on out. All right. <laughs> I really thought I was toast there. I'm not going to lie. Nice job, little, little obsidian slime. Thank you. I'm beautiful. Listen. Listen. All right. You want a little reward. By reward, I mean I'm really gosh darn mad that you killed my only mutant skeleton. I, I killed one of them, and then you killed the other one. So now you're going to solitary. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Before you send me to solitary. Can't get me if I teleport back in. <laughs> oh, you want to fight another one, don't you? No, 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 no. Nah, I'm just wait, kidding. Wait, That's wait, all wait. I had. What did I just grab? Oh, <gasps> no. Flipping way. It was actually. Oh, my God. I literally thought maybe I was going to get some arrows or something. Oh, are you going to kill me? Can you stop 
pressing my buttons. <laughs> Sorry, I found something. I saw it from up there. Okay, well, I can't tell you that, but I, I found something useful. You just don't get to know because you're kind of my enemy right now. All right, little slime. It's why Why am I going to solitary? Don't don't kill my mutant skeletons. That's, Maybe this won't happen. That's dumb. You threw me against your mutant. We're literally on day 88. This is going to bring me to the last Happy two days. Happy days. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm going to have two days to get out of here. I think I might fail. Hello? Oh, I'm free. From days 88 to 98, I was thrown back into solitary and stuck for another 10 days. However, the boss dropped the last slime block I needed, so I could at least finish the last part of the slime lab. I'm really hoping it has some way for me to blow up the front gate, or I will literally fail this challenge. Because with only two days left remaining, that was my only hope. Hello down there. Oh, there we are. 98. Yes, it's let me out, please. 10 days. Yes, I know. I have two days to get out of here. Now, let me out. All right. Welcome back to the land of the living, but not for long. Yeah, that's fine. Don't you get on my bad side, boy. Don't you get on my bad side. Yeah, I'm just going to make my way back to the slime pin. What would I ever do that's bad? He's watching me go back to the slime pin. Okay. When I wrap around this tower, he'll lose sight of me so I can cut back. Uh, so let's quickly jump back down. Quickly go back to the lab. Open the lab. Go to the bottom. Let's step on this. Switch to a diamond slime. Now we just need to make our way and test this out once and for all to see if it works. So let's go open this up. There we go. Jump here and jump there. We did it. We did it. We did it. What are we unlocking? What is it? It doesn't even say what it is. Okay, well, I don't know what it is. So uh, I guess we're just going to step on it and see what happens here. Here we go. What is it giving me? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, my God. I just turned into a creeper slime. So instead of, uh, like, exploding like I could do, I apparently get dynamite, which I can throw instead. So that's how the creeper slime works. I apparently get dynamite. So that's exactly what I need to exit. I also believe, so I type slash explode. Apparently I also will explode, but it will cost me a bunch of health. So that makes no sense to use. I'll just use the dynamite to blow up the front gate. The slash explode could kill me. So no, thank you. And we are out of here. Let's go. So we are the creeper slime. We can blow this up. It is day 98. We're going to wait till tomorrow, till day 99 to do this final heist. But with the creeper slime, we can officially escape. Okay, it is day 99. Time for the final heist. There it is. So now we just need to go ahead and get to the front gate, use our dynamite to blow it up, and we are out of here. I don't see unicorn, which is a good sign. Okay, so let's go over to the front gate, pop this dynamite off. Hopefully unicorn's not nearby, and we can make a smooth getaway. All we need to do is actually get out the front gate, hide till day 100, and we will have beaten the challenge because we waited till the day 100 to escape, and we then stayed alive till the day 100. So let's just go over here to the front gate. We'll check a couple of these bad boys over. Should blow up the front gate. Yeah, there we go. Now we just gotta get the other side. Oh God, does he see me? He's I know you're in the brush. Oh, he's there. Yeah, he's there. We gotta go. We gotta go. He sees me, but I just blocked him off. I blocked him off. Throw it over there. Quick. Please don't oh, blow me up. Oh, you think you're so funny. I Once do. Once that blows up, I'm coming through. Yeah, okay. Bye. <laughs> Dude, he's gonna actually catch me. What is he gonna do? He doesn't fit. He's not tall enough. I can literally get away. Okay, we have to find a hiding spot. We gotta find a hiding spot. So we gotta survive to day 100. Can we see him? Yeah, we see him. But he won't see us. I think we just got away with it. He's going back. He's giving up. Yes! That means we just have to wait here till day 100, and we will have officially completed this challenge. <gasps> there it is, right there, day 100. We did it. It's officially day 100. Perfect. We have done it. 100 days as a slime is officially complete, meaning the challenge is over. Thanks for watching. If you watched all the way through, let me know in the comments down below by typing the word baloney, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.